Hey guys, this is Jen. All right, you see this little thing right here? It looks like a pretty cool, I think they're called chrysanthemums. It's done by just using your uh, monograms, your initials. This one is done with a bone style font. Okay, I'll show you how to do one of these really, really quick. Let me get rid of this one here. Pull this over here. Just make okay. I'm actually going to get rid of that. We'll shrink this down. Actually, I'll just do it real quick by doing it that way, and I'm going to move it off the page. Okay, so this will be our outside. I'm going to come up here, duplicate, rotated. So this can be your inside, or your outside, I'm sorry. You can adjust the spacing. So let me select everything, come up here to path, union, and you've seen, like I said, those popular, a lot of people were doing snowflakes with them. I think this is a little bit prettier, but then again, I do like flowers. Okay, so pull in your next one, and again, do the same thing. And you can do as much, as little as you want to give it the look that you would like to achieve. Two page. Grab your next one. Change the size if you want. You can also make it thicker. So they're in with each other. Oops. Let's try to do an exclude and see what we get. Okay. But there you go. That's how you use your initials to get a flower. And you can keep going. Do whatever you want. Just make sure that when you're done... Um, if you want to draw, that you come over here and that you set that line type in your cuts a lot to draw. So let's come up here. We've got the cut line. Let's show the draw. There we go. All right, so then it's ready for you when you export it. It'll come up as a draw file. All right, guys. Have a good day. If you need me, find me over at Scan and Cut Canvas and Scow Help on Facebook. Thanks, guys.